Pokemon Heart Gold with their with their exclusives. You know who we start with? Monkey. Monkey's back. Yay. My favorite. Okay, first I was silver with Angie Monk. I just did a couple low kicks and I did it in. And I, funny enough, he created me, so Anger Point kicked in, so I only took two. Alright, my next team member I caused Spinarak. I named it Janine. Yes, yeah, Heart Gold exclusive. I don't know if I specified it yet. Then I fight uh Faulkner. Karate Chop one shot his Pidgeotto because of a uh, of a focus energy, Cry Shop took out Pidgeotto twice. Luckily, I didn't miss. Alright. Tentify Proton. And well, I nitrated down his Zubat and his coughing. Did do some hit myself confusion hijinks. I didn't take him out eventually, but I got it eventually. Alright, to fight Bugs, the elite off of Janine. He goes for Bugs, he goes for focus energy and quick attacks my Janine to death. I send out An Angie Monk, and well, it couldn't do anything. The Scyther. Alright, I've set fight Silver after grinding a bit. My Janine's now Ari Ariados. I Shadow Sneak a one-shot its Ghastly. Nightshade takes out Quilaba. And it pushes off Shadow Sneak, blasts up Zubat. A couple of Shadow Sneaks does it in. Alright, time to rematch Falk Bugsy, I meant. He goes for Focus Energy, I go for Nightshade, he goes for Quick Attack. I keep going for Nightshade, he hits Barry, and Nightshade takes him out. Next up, and, la and well, the rest is a sweep because it's a Metapod Kakuna. Seriously. Should've given this guy a Pinsler and a Heracross. That would've been a dope team. Oh well. I guess I have my next team member, which is Growlithe. I name it Pupper. Yeah. Heart Gold has some pretty cool exclusives. Alright, time to fight uh, Faulkner. He leads off with Clefairy. Flame Wheels do it in. Takes up his Melted. I try to go for Lear, but he attracts me and I fall him up. Push out to Janine. I go for Stomp. He goes for Stomp. I go for Poison Sting. I poison it eventually, but it eats a Lumberry to heal its poison. I eventually go down. I send out Main Monk, Angie Monk, and I take it out a couple Karate Chops, and that was Whitney. Woo wee. Time to fight Silver. He leads off a ghastly level of pupper. He confuses me, but I bite through it. Next up is his is his Magnemite. For some reason, I go, a flame wheel one shots it. Next up is his Zubat. I just go for flame wheel two shots it. And last up is Quilava. And Quilava is annoying little bastard because it spams smoke screen. What is this revenge that didn't pick you Legends Arceus? Quilava, huh? All right, switch out to Angie Monk, and I just get out a couple karate chops. God, that was annoying though. All right, time to fight Morty. He leads off a ghastly level of Janine. I start Shadow Sneaking it, one shot is Ghastly, next up is Haunter, I Shadow Sneak, but he goes for Curse to finish himself off. Next up is Gengar, so shout out to Angie Monkey, get rid of it, he gets taken out by Shadow Ball. I send out Pupper, I go for Bite, as he goes for Shadow Ball, he me out one health, then he takes him out Shadow Ball, I send out Janine, I keep going for Shadow Sneaks, and a critical Shadow Sneak takes him out as he mean looks me. Last up, is last up is his last Haunter, a couple Shadow Sneaks does it in, as it also kills it as it goes for mean look. He also heals it, which is annoying. He keeps healing it, but I eventually take it out. Alright, guess my next team member, which is Mantine. Yes, I did it. I named it Kite, because I'm creative. Kites. If I chuck, lose off a Primate, I Karate Chop it, he leers me, and another Karate Chop takes it out. This is Polyrath. Just for Focus Punch, I start Karate Chopping it, breaking his focus. I, I, he eventually starts Body Slamming me, puts, he uses Surf, then he heals, then he, then he puts me to sleep, eventually, after he kept getting tired of missing fucking Focus Punch, so I can take it out next turn after he heals. And uh, Kites, I keep going for Wing Attack, and I bet you do take him out. Alright, next up is Jasmine. Cryo Chop one shots her Magnemite. Next up is our Magnemite, Cryo Chop one shots it. Next up is Steelix. I decide to stay in, start Cry Chop it, hits me with Iron Tail. I keep Cry Chop it, it takes me out with an Iron Tail. Now Kites, and a Surf finishes it off. Alright, trying to fight, uh. What's his name? Petrol. I just Surf swept his entire team because his Pokemon have a low special defense. Besides Raticate, you took one, that's a different story. Alright, time for the double battle. I just spammed Surf while Dragon Knight went for Fly. We took out most of their team. Hell. I did more damage. Murkrow actually took a Surf and a took a Surf to surprise me because I thought it was a bit weaker, but that's a different story. And Gloom, we took it out with a Wing Attack and a Fly combo. Alright, time to fight on the main man himself, Price. He was off a CL, he'd off with Angie Monk. He goes for Karate Chop, he goes for Icy Wind. Another Karate Chop, he goes for Rest. I bet you take him out with Karate Chops. Next up is his Dugong, which stalled like a bitch. Like, I always have more trouble with his Dugong than I do with Pillow Swine. So I eventually switch out to Janine and get rid of the attack drop I got from Aurora Beam. I start Leech Life Minute, poison it, you know, just do damage on it, but he keeps resting because that's what Dugong does. I eventually go down. And then Angie Monk, now that I lost my attack and speed, I, he's gone. I was able to take out a couple of Cry Chops. So Pillow Swine done one critical Cry Chop. So normally I'd wait to comment until I've done more, but I just want to show you this next bullshit fight, not Petrol. Silver. So, Petrol was easy. I just surf swept this entire team. Weezing, poisoning me with sludge. That's all That's all really happened in this fight. What happens when you have five coughings and one wheezing? What the fuck happened to his Raticate? And Zubat. But no, okay. Here, alright, now that he's done with here's the real bullshit. Silver time. I'll lead off with Mantine, because I taught it Ice Beam. I get confused. I hit myself three times in a row of confusion, 
And then the next two turns, he hit these flinches me with bites, and I just die. Great. I send out Pupper, and I eventually take him out with Pupper. It's just... My god, I got Ice Beam for flying types for Manti. I also know it could move, but I just... That happens. I'll just get out a Shadow Ball. I'll take it out with a couple of insurances. Luckily, I don't hit myself with Confusion. Kalava, I hit with Rock Tomb, then he smoke screens me. I took it out with a couple of Cry Chops and Sneasel. Went down... He's on Magnum, I've down a couple of cry chops, listen if you want Sneasel, but god damn it, that look. And if I pro Proton, he's off with Golbat. My Ice Beam once and two shot it. See, this is how it was supposed to go with the Silvers, but that's a different story. Then a couple Surfs took down his, uh, Weezing. Alright, Ariana time. She's off of Arbok, with off Pupper. I flamethrower it down, a couple flamethrowers take it out as it crunches me. <clears throat> Murkrow finishes off Pupper. And then I send out Kites to take it out with an Ice Beam. The last up's her Vile Plume, I just take it out with a few Ice Beams. Funny how Ice Beam is my main attack for this, even though I have even though I have a flying type move. But it's physical. Alright, time to fight uh Archer. The it's like I said, the most forgettable person ever. It was literally a surf sweep because it was fire types and call things low special defense. Surprisingly, Hounding took it, but hit me with a faint attack, so I did that went nowhere. And Copping went down to the surf. Yeah. Main villain, huh? I catch Gligar, I game it Fang, and I catch Fountain Ember, Fampy, and I name it Tusk. Alright, turn to fight Clay, I lead off with Pupper to take the Intimidate and start leering it down. Eventually, I go down to Dragon Rages. But I was able to get his minus three. I send out Tusk, I get Quick Claw popped, and I Thunder Fanged it from Movie I got from Movie Learner. Except Kingdra, I send out Fang to take to, to, be a, to be a sacrifice. I send out Kites, he goes for Smoke Screen, I go for Confuse Ray. Then I switch out Janine for another sacri for a sacrifice, which I hit with Sucker Punch, so a couple Hydro Pumps, and I go down. As now kites again, I start ice beaming it. It dragon pulses me, gets a crit, and then I switch out to tusk. It goes for dragon pulse, I eat it. Hydro pump kills me, I send out angry monk, cross chop pinches it off. And then I then next up dragon air, I go for cross chop, critical hit one shot, so sub other dragon air. I miss my cross chop, thunder wave, dragon rage. I hit it with I cross chop it, it doesn't kill. She heals, so I hit it with rock to lower its speed. But when angry monk gun down, kites had a chance to outspeed it and killed it with ice beam. All right, final silver fight time. Flamethrower one sh flame wheel one shots a sneasel. Yes, still using Flame Wheel, 40, level 41. Next up is Golbat. Confu it confuses me. I hit it with Flame Wheel and a Flamethrower. And I actually burn it, and the burn kills it. Next up is Haunter. Hits me with Shadow Ball. I live at 3. I go for Bite. Takes me out with the Shadow Ball. I then send out Deneen to finish it off the Shadow Sneak. Next up is her Kadabra. I go for Sucker Punch. But the, it went for Disable, so Shadow Sneak killed it one shot. Next up is Typhlosion. I swapped out the Kites. It goes for a Lava Plume. Then Swift. Then I Surf it down. Two Surfs take it out. Last up is her Magneton. I sw sent out Gligar. And I took it out with an Earthquake. Yeah, time to fight the Elite Four. Yay. Elite Four time. Will's up first. He leads off with a Zatu lead off with Pupper. I just crunched through it. Next up is a Slowbro. I crunched and I actually lowered his defense. Surprisingly, he didn't go for any water attacks. He just went for a curse and I killed it with another crunch. Next up is his Jinx. Flare Blitz one shot at it. Next up is his Executor. Flare Blitz one shots it. Next up is his other Zatu and I take it out with another crunch. Alright, time to fight Koga. I lead off a of Pupper again. Flamethrower one shots Ariados. Next up is Fortress. I don't know why I sent out Fortress against Fire types. Killer one shots. Next up is Muck. Flare Blitz surprisingly one shots it, because I thought it was tankier. Probatch has a double team, but Flare Blitz almost takes it out. He eats his berry. I go for a Flamethrower and I take it out. Last up is his Venomoth, and well, you can assume what happened there. Alright, time to fight, uh, Fr Byer. What the? F Bruno. I, I was able to Swords Dance up. Max and I just swept through his entire team with Earthquakes, besides on his Onyx, which I Iron Tail to save a bit of Earthquake PP. I don't know why. You know, sitting here realizes, I realize how useless an Earthquake is against Lance. Literally, all of his Pokemon are part flying type. He's a, more, he's a bird master, not a dragon tamer. That's a different story. Alright, Karen time. She's up with Umbreon, lead off with Angry, Angie Monk. Cross Chops? Probably one shot's Umbreon. Except Murkrai. I miss. I go for Rock Tomb, barely don't kill. Sh no, even though I missed one, so I fucking go for Karate Chops, I bet you take it out. Except for Gengar, go for Assurance, and takes me out with Focus Blast for some reason. I don't know why I didn't go for Shadow Ball. Send out to Jean, Sucker Punch to finish it off. Next up's Hound Doom. I sacked off Janine, and I sent out Tusk, it goes, and I take it out with the Earthquake. Yay. I forgot. Dawn Fan actually learns what ground type moves in this. I sacked off and off, gets Valley Flame, hit it with the Earthquake, and it takes me out with Pedal Dance. I send out, send out Kites, and take it out with the Nice Beam. Alright, time to fight Lance. He leads off with Gyarados. I Poison Jab. I send out, I poison jab it, but he switches after that to Aerodactyl. I poison that sucker punch it for a bit. Then I send out Tusk, goes for Air Lace. I go for Rollout, try to get a chain up, but he sends out Gyarados. Then, you know, the Intimidate drops my attack, so it takes me out of a couple waterfalls. Alright, I send out, send out Pupper, and I, I go for Crunch, he goes for Waterfall, I crunch to death. Next up Dragonite, I go for Dragon Pulse, taking 75% to eat this berry, he takes me out with Outrage. Kites, Ice Beams it, one shots it. Next up is other Dragonite, 
he gets Ice Beam one shots because he missed Thunder. Luckily, I'm surprised I didn't hit with my luck. Uh, his other Dragonite, Thunder Waves, even Ice Beam takes it out one shot. Last up is Charizard, which goes down to, 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 to two Surfs. It's going to be a Dragon Claw. Yeah, that could have gone a whole lot worse. Blue time. He leads off with Executor. I lead off with Fang. I go for X Scissor. Billy don't kill. He gets Relief Storm. So I size it up a, a Swords Dance while he heals. Then the next X Scissor takes him out. This is Gyarados. Since I don't really have anything for Gyarados, I decide to sack him off as he takes me out of the turn. Now Tusk goes for Waterfall. I flinch. And then I take him out with Thunder Fang. Next up is Arcanine. I switch out to Pupper to get his Intimidate. But he gets a crit Critical Flare Blitz on me. Then Dragon Pulse to me. I crunch him. Get a crit back. He swatches the Machamp. They go for Flare Blitz, taking out Machamp, and also myself in Recoil. Now, Angie Monks is out right up, right on. Cross Chop takes him out. Does Pidgeot go for Thunder Punch, do a little under half. I get Critical Thunder Punch, finishing him off. Last up is Arcanine again. I just get, takes me out with Extreme Speed. I send out Tusk, and I take it out with an Earthquake <laughs> for, for a quick Claw Boost. Alright, time to fight Red. I set up three Swords Dances. While well, almost on the Iron Tail, I use Earthquake to take out Pikachu. Next up is Lapras. I use Earthquake to take it out. I basically sweep till he sends out his Charizard. Surprisingly, watch out his Snorlax, who know plus six, but that's, that's, that surprised me. His Charizard, so I really can't do anything to it. I just used X Scissor on it when it actually did come out. Really doing any damage. And he takes the Fang out because of, you know, 30 health from Hail. Wow, I did nothing, too. That's how it shows you. Then I sent out Tusk. I go for Rollout. The Hail makes Charizard heal. I go for Rollout, take him out. Then he sets up Venusaur, takes me out Giga Drain. And then. I send out Arcanine, take it out the Flare Blitz, and that was red, and we beat Pokemon Heart Cold with only their exclusives. The exclusivity works, people. Alright, now it's Pokemon Heart Cold with only the exclusive Pokemon in it. Hope you all enjoyed, I'll see y'all next time. Peace.